Japan is widely known for their amazing food, incredible animations, unforgettable soundtracks, and, in my humble opinion as a low-key stationery addict, most importantly, their incredible and insanely popular school supplies. Chances are you use or have at least seen mild liners, pentel pens, tombow brush pens, all of which are amazing and made in Japan. But recently, those are not the only Japanese stationery products getting a lot of attention, because these past few years, some more unusual, if not downright weird Japanese school supplies have been going viral on both YouTube and TikTok, most of which I have never tried before. So today we are going to be testing some of the most viral Japanese school supplies and see if they're really worth the sometimes insanely high price tag or if they're overhyped. And I ended up ordering the stationery from two online stores, Bungu, whose videos on Japanese stationery went viral on TikTok, and JetPens, who went viral on YouTube. And I'll also be rating the two shops and their service and prices relative to other stores as well. So first up, we're going to test the stationery that went viral on Bungu's TikTok page, so hajime mashou. Oh my gosh, it broke, it broke, it broke, it broke, it broke! Aha! So it's when I do it a little longer. So it has to be really short. Oh my gosh, is this a pen? So smooth, oh my god.
first up is the cutest pen case ever. Look at this. Look at this pen case. Tell me this is not adorable. It is so soft. It is like, it's so soft. I love it. Why am I so obsessed with this? Okay. When I was in elementary school, I would have died from happiness from this. It's so cute. Get in there. Oh no, does it not fit? Oh no, it fits. Okay. It's like, this is a standard pencil and it doesn't fit. It all fit. Look at that. Oh my gosh, I love him. Anyways, look, he can sit. Like, you can do all the different positions, it's so cool. Like that, you can go like a split, like like that, like a lie down. This is my favorite. This is, this is it. This wins by like a million times. Doesn't seem to matter what I do. I'm always number two. Oh, this comes out. Oh my gosh, okay. I understand now. Okay, so there's a pocket here in the front. There's the main compartment with a colored insert, and then there's a back pocket. No! Okay, it doesn't fit. Does it not fit? Good enough? Yeah, I guess. Meh. It keeps falling. Oh, maybe if I put the insert though, maybe it'll help. Okay. Oh my gosh, they literally have this. Look. Okay, we're gonna do that. We're gonna put you in here. You're halfway there. Wow! Living on a prayer. Okay. Come on, come on. Okay. And now we close. We say goodbye. Why do you not close now? Hooray! So this is the Kokuyo and Go like this. Like this. Let's put a bunch of pens in this now. Hold up, this is just regular lead. Okay, let's try that again. It's blue! Eight kinds of lead in one holder. So is this a pencil or a pen? Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on. Hold your horses there. Hold on. Oh my gosh, it's still yellow. Oh wait, is there only yellow in here? 
Oh no, I broke it! No! Oh my gosh, I broke the lid. I'm so bad. Okay, I'm so sorry. But I want you to go in. Get out. Oh, wait, there's a red in here too? I'm so confused. So the lady I watched said that this has to line with the arrow with this. And it is. And then I can't take it out. It gets stuck. But then when I switch it to the other side, to the back, it does come out. Completely. I'm so confused. So she says to do it like that. But then it doesn't fit. So then, if I, but if I turn it to the back, then it does. But it doesn't go all the way down. It just gets stuck. I am so confused. I broke it! Okay, I am miserably failing at this. I've tried this like five times and I've broken five leads and I don't want to keep doing it. So can someone please help me? If anyone owns this pen, pencil, I don't know, I'll keep watching tutorials, I guess, but it just, it, I don't know what's happening. I don't understand. I can't get it to work. Like, it only works when it goes to the back. I feel so guilty. <laughs> this is reminding me of the Polar Express right now. I'm just like... Believe. B. E. Yep, it did it. All right, let's see if these are better than those teeny ones. Nope, these are just as bad. Oh wait, no, I got it. Okay, I, I got this. Go straight. There we go. Wait, no, not really. Wait, okay, I mean, better than nothing. All right, let's try this one. Ooh. Go straight. Okay, I'm not that bad. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, no, 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 go down, go down, go down. I struggle with these pens, but the actual pen feels good quality, like the ink feels fine. Okay, no. Straight line, straight line, straight line. There we go, there we go. Nee! Okay, this one smells really nice. I really like it. This is great. This is a paper smell though. Like Elle Woods' is paper. It smells, it does smell a tiny bit on the paper. Okay, so I give this five stars. This one is Cookie. Oh my gosh, okay, I like Cookie even more though. Cookie is like sweet potato on steroids. I love it, oh my gosh, okay. Oh my gosh, you can totally smell it on the paper. Okay, it is really strong. Peaches, 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 peaches. Okay. I really like this one. Okay, so now let's try the boring version that doesn't smell. Speaking of Brilliant, a big thank you to today's sponsor Brilliant for helping making this video possible because Estella definitely went way over the budget that we originally planned, right Estella? We definitely didn't need to buy all of the- <coughs> Um, now on to the sponsorship you know, segment, ha 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 It's super helpful when study sessions are fun, interesting, and engaging since boring material or lessons can make us feel tired and less focused. And that's where Brilliant.org, the sponsor of today's video, comes in since they use a hands-on visual approach that makes learning engaging and helps you stay focused and energetic when learning. Brilliant is the best way to learn math and computer science interactively and has thousands of lessons from foundational and advanced math to physics to data science to neural networks.
textbooks with new lessons added monthly. I'm currently starting to prepare to take the GRE for grad school, so I'm reviewing geometry since it's one of the four areas on the test, and brilliance diagrams and visual examples are super helpful to quickly learn or rehash the concepts found on the quantitative reasoning section. It's definitely a much more fun and engaging way to review math than just staring at a textbook that puts me to sleep, so to try everything Brilliant has to offer free for a full 30 days, visit brilliant.org slash study to success or click the link in the description. The first 200 of you will get 20% off of Brilliant's annual premium subscription, so be sure to check it out today. Up next on study to success, nope, that's not what I'm supposed to say, hold on. Up next on part two of testing Japanese stationery. So nice, so smooth. Oh my gosh. <gasps> chunk fell off. 